My channel is not about doing sponsored product reviews. There are other channels out there for this. However, I could not find any videos on this new drone apart from those which are not in English. This is not a paid review. I paid to purchase this drone. I was looking for a small drone that I could carry easily when out on my Brompton bike and which didn't require anyone to operate the drone while cycling, just to capture a few clips for my videos. This drone is small and unlike the previous model, it does not fold up. It is lighter at only 99 grams and they claim this design makes it more durable when hitting objects. It came with three batteries along with a twin charger, two other propellers and a soft bag to carry the drone. On the 8th of July, I received this email offer for the new Hover Air X1 Smart, which previously was only available in Japan. I paid $409 USD, which worked out to be $639.42 Australia dollars, including freight. Here are some of the flight modes that operate from a press of the button on the drone. Flight modes include bird's eye, orbit, hover, zoom out, and follow. There are additional options, which include dolly track, sidetrack, and smart control. These are presets, but you can customize these further if you download the app. You will notice this drone keeps you as the main focus. However, you can use the app in manual control to allow you to fly the drone when capturing your surrounds when you don't want to be in the video. No good looking models available, so you have to look at me. It's winter in Sydney, hence the beanie, and yes, I should have taken my cycling gloves off. Well, that's it. I did tell you that product reviews is not something I do, but I thought you would find this interesting. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. It's free and it helps my channel to grow.